My name is Bridget and welcome to The Retailer TV. I am so excited to be joining you guys today and I'll be talking about something really spectacular. I'll be talking about... <laughs> Not this, but my brother got me this and I'm so excited. Thank you so much to my amazing brother for this. You are the best. Back to this. Today I'll be talking about how to market yourself. I had a brief conversation with a friend who was saying, oh, um, it's not you, you have to allow it to flow organically and blah, 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 and a lot of things. But no, I'm here to say something entirely different from that. It is not, it, you don't leave this to being organic. If it was organic, a lot of, um, what they call them, local government chairmen, or chairmen would have won, and chair women, but they're not winning and they have friends. So don't leave anything organically. You have to work your way to that point. First, create a niche for yourself. You have to have a niche. People have to know you for something. Don't be here today and here tomorrow. You can't be an interior decorator today and you are a fashion designer. You can match them, yeah? But not immediately. You have to like first create a niche for yourself. Just like when the band, I don't know his full name, but the band, I'll put it up here somewhere. When the band started, he's um, Coco Gary. I'm sure a lot of people are interested. I don't know if it's still selling, but yo, a lot of people are interested because they already know him for something. You can only sell other things when you have a niche and people know you for that because then you're a trusted brand. So, have a niche. And secondly, build a community. You have friends, yeah? Okay, that's okay. But you need to build a new community. Aside your friends, you need to try to know a lot of other people speak to a lot of other people know what they know and share what you know as well if you okay i'm a fashion designer i run a brand called at joshu apparel international and i started a youtube channel this is because i'm trying to build a whole new kind of community where people can affiliate me with my fashion brand and my personal brand so build communities there's several things you can do there's several communities you can form or join. So build yourself a community, okay? Thirdly, be of service. You really need to be of service because it's one thing to, I'm sorry, I'm sorry I was distracted. It's one thing to be, okay, I'm building a community, I'm building a community. And after a while, everyone is like, okay, now the community is here. What are we doing? You have to be of service. You have to render services. You can't keep taking information, you can't keep zapping everything in or I don't know, absorbing everything. You also have to emit some form of energy, some form of service. So develop your own line of service and render services. Lastly, this is the most important of them all, I think. Be social. I know people who aren't on Instagram, aren't on maybe maybe they're on Facebook but they're not active, aren't on LinkedIn. You're on LinkedIn, you're looking for a job and you don't like yo, do you guys know what social media does for you? I know that a lot of people are using social media the wrong way, but you can't have a business and not be on social media. You can't have a business and you are not going out, you're not hanging out with people, you're not knowing, you don't know what's happening, you don't know who is who, you don't know what's you can't be in fashion and you don't know some particular brands. Like be social, be out there, know everything, every information. Let people also see you let them be able to look you up somewhere okay and on this note i've come to the end of the retailer tv if you haven't subscribed to my channel i'm not sure why but please do like share and leave your beautiful comments lots of love Mwah. please sign in to the bridges sailor okay no just sign in please